My name is Vincent Remo. I am from Cuenca, Batangas. Now I'm the Vice President for Solutions Development in a Japanese software company. It's called Advanced World Solutions Incorporated. I actually graduated here twice, in high school in 1989 and with the MMT program in the year 2006. So I am proud to say that I am an alumnus of the MMT program of De La Salipa. Fondest memories would be with the teachers, with my classmates. In De La Salipa, you can have fun while learning. That's one thing that's unique here, and I'm proud to say that you know my, my classmates, be it in high school or in uh, the MMT program, we were always having fun. I had a, a few choices of uh, universities here in Batangas uh, where to enroll in my masteral class, uh, but I chose La Salipa, mainly because I graduated here in high school and I know the quality of education that, uh, that I got. The MMT program was not really well known during that time because there were a lot of universities offering MBA programs. But as a person coming from a technical field, when I read about the course that it's management but with a touch of technology, I told myself this is the course for me. This should be my master's degree. And well, lo and behold, I'm, I'm now a graduate and I was proven right that this course is you know, really uh, appropriate for us. It's a combination of the management skills and also the, the skills that we need to work on our uh, technical expertise as well. My advice to those who are torn between taking a step further, meaning enrolling in a master's degree or pursuing another degree perhaps, is to go for it. As I mentioned, learning should never stop. And in my experience, it has given me the balance that I needed. I was able to get balance between my actual job experience and also the learnings or the skills, the theories that's involved in all of these things. To those who are still undecided whether to take a master's degree or a, a, no, an, another degree, it should not be a matter of uh, whether you would like to take it or not. It's just a matter of when you should do it. And so for those who are, you know, they have the capability to be enrolled in respected and uh, well-known universities, take the chance, be good at it, never forget that Life is a continuous learning process. One of the reasons why I am teaching here part-time in De La Salle is that I wanted to give back uh, to the community. I wanted to give back to the community in the way that I know how, which is imparting knowledge perhaps, or sharing my experiences so that others would learn as well. Um, I believe that our society would be a better place to live in if everybody would have or would be given the chance to share their knowledge, their expertise, as well as their capabilities, and be able to hone their skills further as, as leaders of the community.